Heart of Darkness. It. Wow. Do you read anything besides Stephen King? Hell no. Journey to the Center of the Earth. That was a classic. And how does your wife put up with it? All right, here we go. Look. Bravo, this is Sierra. We have a black SUV approaching. Right on time. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta change position. Bravo, this is Sierra. Weapons confirmed. Check. Engagement orders. Sit me down, big guy. We've got plenty of time. And I see my fit there. You seeing this? Unreal. What the hell is that guy doing here? Bravo requesting new target of opportunity. High value target, Sanan Al Had. We may not get another shot. It's your call, but we're out here alone. Shit. Okay, we got six visible targets. If they get their hands on those boxes, it's gonna get hot up here. Target locked.
minute! Go! Hey! We gotta go, man! Go! Go! Come on! Sweetheart. Oh my god, it is so good to see your face. Oh, you too. Everything good? I'm coming home for a couple weeks. Really? Yeah. Well, that's great news. That means you can be my plus one. Plus what? All right, you remember me talking about Darren Connor, my super rich client, owns like a bazillion different businesses, real estate, hotels, casinos. Yeah, the one who wrote that stupid get rich book. Yeah. What was it? Why shouldn't you have it all? He's opening a new resort, and guess who's in charge of his super deluxe invite only? Opening bash. Who? You're an ass. Yeah, sometimes. So how about it? Five days of sun, beach. It's just a short trip for you. I was really just looking forward to getting back home. Back to Michigan. I'm sorry, it's my job. Bad timing, I know. Why don't you just come home? You're my home. And it doesn't matter where I am. I love you back. Oh my god. Isn't it beautiful? Sure is. Hmm. You're still a little far away, huh? A little bit, yeah. It's okay, I guess. I mean, if you're into paradise, you know, you know. Oh! oh. <laughs> ah, oh you want to play, huh? Right. All right. Robin? Oh, nice to finally meet you. Oh, my gosh. Cynthia, this is my husband. Joe, Robin's told me a lot about you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Our goal is to have the most energy-efficient resort in this part of the world. As you know, this island rests in close proximity to uh, the volcanic corridor. Oh, yeah. Everyone knows that. So, we've constructed our own geothermal plant, allowing us to use heat for power. Impressive security. Yes! 24-hour armed guards in the security towers, top of the line surveillance. We're actually having our opening party here tomorrow night. You're going in. Come here. Ah! <laughs> ah! <Yep. laughs> Be careful! I gotta go to a meeting. I mean, I know you see exotic spots like this all the time, but this is pretty decent for us civilian folk. Sierra, you copy? Affirmative. 
Hmm. You know, I haven't seen you like this since... Well, since ever. Last one was bad, huh? Yeah, it's just one of those sideways. Anything you could have done? I don't know. I just got a closer look than I usually get. You want to talk about it? Just thinking about a change. Wow. Well, not to put ideas in your head, but you know I'm proud of you. Whether you're saving the world or sweeping a floor. <laughs> you know, I knew there was some good reason I married you. You have very low expectations. <laughs> it's so nice to see someone's having a good time. I was just waiting for you to arrive. Darren Connor, this is my husband. Joe Linwood. Soldier, right? Actually, he's a Marine. Hmm, right. Can I talk with you? I'm getting 20 phone calls an hour from some Kosang representative. I have a reporter from some local rag up my ass for an interview who I do not want to give. And some Greenpeace lawyer trying to hit me with injunctions. So could you just please do your job now, thank you? Absolutely. On my way. Pleasure. You need to replace the champagne. It's just the kitchen I would not give to my dog. And you thought your job was dangerous, huh? No. I like him, really. <laughs> I'll be back as soon as I can. I got a surprise for you. I was up here. Yes, I have them for you. <coughs> uh, okay. The kid doing okay. fishing on the beach. May is I suggest an electrical fence for these? Yes, an electrical fence. I'm from the resort. They said you could be booked for a snorkeling tour. We're not exactly up and running yet. Do tell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, please. Uh, a favor for your fellow Yankees. Oh, hell. Well, if you're gonna hit me in that soft spot of mine, I guess so. <sighs> but just so you know, one Yankee to another, I'm gonna overcharge you. Oh, well, thanks for the heads up. He talk? Uh, not if he can get away with it. Uh. Trophy husband. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Your choice. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. You grunt? No. Jarhead. Yeah. yeah, Marine. Mm -hmm. I thought so. Where are you on up? Paris Island or Pendleton? Pendleton. Yeah. Hollywood monkey, huh? Force recon. You? Just a uh, regular SF Ranger. Explosives. Engineer, I blew shit up. Powder monkey, huh? <laughs> mm -hmm. Once upon a time, yeah? Joe. Joe? Church. Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, come on. Let's get you all geared up. Right? Yeah? Yeah. Does, uh, does this mean you're not gonna overcharge me now? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yellow, good choice. Sharks love yellow. That's great, baby. <laughs> He's choking.
this was on any of the maps until your fancy resort showed up. Hmm. It gets better. The other end of that beach, there's a cave. It leads you right back to your resort. Just make sure you head west, okay? They teach you that in the uh, Marine Corps, don't they? The difference between east and west? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Whoa! Go get him, honey. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> This is amazing. You know, it could be like this all the time. You, me, jet setting around the world. You're a professional plus one? Yeah. Until the first day you got bored. I know who I married, Joe. And I couldn't be happier. Yeah, right. This goes back to the resort. Yeah, wow. That's east. We gotta go west. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Powder Monkey. Well, Church was right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you wanna go back? Go mm, on. I have a party to organize. That reporter was nosing around again, only this time he was pestering Mr. Chavant about his opinion on the Greenpeace legal action against me. Need I remind you that Mr. Chavant is one of our major shareholders? So that is just not acceptable. My apologies, Mr. Connor. I'll get right on it. Oh, please. Now that the damage is done. <laughs> Joe? Oh, great. G.I. Joe's here. What, you got an opinion? Or she's gonna kick my ass. <laughs> no, sir. See, unlike some, I don't pick on women half my size. Oh. And G.I. is army, moron. I'm a Marine. Okay, Joe, it's fine. No, Robin, hey, it's hey, not it's fine. fine. Joe, please. It's fine. Number one, I'm sorry about that. It will not happen again. Number two, the reason you're having trouble with the reporter is because you constantly ignore my recommendation to just give them 20 minutes. I'm not going to talk of your time. with any reporter You've about... you answered the questions you want, and when he brings up the injunctions, you smile sweetly and say it's all being worked out. It can only help you look better and not like a rich American outsider with something to hide. However, first things first, you have an opening speech to give. Good evening, friends, colleagues, and investors. I would like to introduce you to our host, the chairman of Connor Industries, Mr. Darren Connor. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you honor me by being the first official guests of our magnificent new experience. Welcome to the Tanjala Beach Resort, where you will never have to ask yourself, why shouldn't I have it all? You know, before I created Tanjala, there was nothing here. Well, nothing but a wasted opportunity. This fabulous island was flawed by inefficiency, archaic thinking, and a subsequent lack of employment for the local population. But I have changed all that. Water, fire, earth, air. 
They are not hey, Marin! <laughs> Crazy ass powder monkey. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> How many jobs you got anyway? I've been known to move, lad. <laughs> Gonna have a good show tonight. Hey, look at this. Get a kick on this. Pop flare. I threw it up at the end for old time's sake. Ah, military's nightlight. Nobody else gets it, but I don't give a shit. Hmm. What's going on? You and the little woman having a thing? Her boss was being an asshole, and somehow, I'm the bad guy. Yeah, well, don't take it personal, all right? You gotta remember, she's on her own most of the time. Can't be waiting around for your sorry ass to show up and be all macho for her, right? <laughs> yeah. Look, brother, I'm not the kind of guy to be giving a lot of advice. If I were you, I'd polish off those knee pads, head back up there, and tell her how sorry I was. A couple young things like you, I can guarantee you the makeup sex will be well worth it. <laughs> that how you did it? Nope. <laughs> yeah, look at me now, right? King of the world, ma. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Mm. Go on. Beat it. I'm about to light this place up. Solar energy from the sun. Hydroelectric from the ocean. Geothermal from the earth. And the harnessing of wind. On behalf of Connor Industries, I thank you and wish you a very enjoyable vacation. Here's to it! Nice job. These hicks wouldn't know a thermodynamic converter from a hot fart. All they care is it says, please recycle on it. Mm -hmm. What's next? Mingling with the gas. Oh. Excuse me, Mr. Connor. Hate to interrupt.
think you're doing here? Hello, Mr. Kano. She's still inside. It's gonna be okay. Local authorities are on it. Just try to relax, all right? Hey! We're on TV! It's all on TV now! Earlier reports of a terrorist attack on the Panjala Beach Resort capturing as many as 20 hostages. We have confirmation that this video, uploaded via internet minutes ago, comes from inside the resorts. <laughs> last century we have watched helplessly as the disease of the western world has spread across our islands. Now it is your turn to watch. We will kill all the hostages in 24 hours. If you wish to spare their lives, you must pay tribute. Tribute? Infidels. That's you and me, buddy. They gotta pay tribute for their crimes. Like money. Ransom. What? What? No, no, no! No! Don't watch this kid. Get her back. Oh, 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 time out here. Look, there's nothing we can do about that. It's the military's job. Listen, brother, I was never a hero, all right? Okay in a group, part of a team, but something like this? No, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, I can't do it. Okay? We can't identify you. 
We haven't seen your faces. Now you have. Separatists fighting the spread of Western influence on their country. You know what? People are working on getting us out. Okay? We just gotta stay calm and think with clear heads. There's no way for us to keep this quiet. What? Makil Shaw, diplomatic advisor on behalf of the Kusan government. Blueprints to the resort. We have the perimeter surrounded. But I will not attack until we know more about the terrorists. That's all right, Commander. I'm taking care of this. Who's in charge? Sir, this is off limits. Please wait over there. No. Somebody's going to talk to me. Now. Wait. Let me. I apologize for that. You know, dealing with the military. It's like playing chicken with a brick wall. No offense, of course. What's being done about the hostages? I'm afraid I can't discuss it with you, Mr. Joe. Two days is unacceptable. I will be dead tomorrow. Just make it happen. The money is on its way. Tribute. Yeah, sure. Tribute. Whatever you want to call it. But you touch just one hair of my head. You can kiss it all goodbye. Look, just let us go. The money is on its way. You got what you want. I got what I asked for. We were living in paradise long before the great white hope came to our shores to save us from our happiness. You don't know what I want. Think it's working. Either way, little brother, the message will be sent. It's all falling into place. This is a political disaster. I am the one who convinced my government to allow Khan Industry to purchase the old resort from the local owners. Now I have to negotiate the release of the hostages. I can't believe this is happening. I'm with counter security. Are you sending in troops? Oh, my government is extremely reticent to engage in military action. If they should storm in and the hostages are killed, we could have a, an international incident. And we're still waiting on word from the US, which means they're waiting to see how we deal with the problem. So what do you plan to do? I've already done it. Better trained than most of our soldiers. And accustomed to dirty work. Let's get out. Scum. 
How are you? Okay, thanks. And for sale to the highest bidder. Better than letting them die. Hey, Blondie. Nervous or what? Thank you for responding so quickly. Who's that? He's with Connor Securities. Marine Recon. Congratulations. Now, get him out of here. I'm going in with you. Uh-huh. Look, I've been inside. I know the layout. Please, sir. Just leave it to us. With or without you, I'm going in. You do. I'll consider you an enemy and shoot you on sight. You need to stand down. I'm taking over. Take it. Can you tell me what they're saying? I don't know. The intruders will be dead? Team two, copy.
Team two. Something's wrong. Move, quick. one's missing. Blondie, they had a traitor, then maybe we have one too. You took charge. 
I was trying to help. I was trying to save the hostages. I had to do something. You compromised everything with your help. You are done. Get out of my sight. Calm down, calm down. Calm down, just tell me what happened. Calm down. Blondie said there was an American Marine with them. Is he still alive? No, he's dead. But he killed our men. Our men. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> How did they infiltrate your team? We are mercenaries. We work for the highest bidder. I guess they paid more. Can you please step out? We must make an example! We must make a statement! Kill them all now! Not yet, not yet. Robin. I really... I am really very sorry. We have to wait for the tribute. Now stay focused. They must pay for this. Yes, they will. They will. They will. Just be patient. Be patient. Small example, brother. You gonna be okay? Oh. Could you please deliver my message? Her and her. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? Blood for blood. You take my people, I take yours. You already took those men you killed out there. You got your blood! What are you doing? Now you're just a hypocrite. Everybody thinks you are. Move it! Stop! Just stop right there. You only get your tribute if you can prove I'm alive and well. I'll make you kill me if I have to. Church, I need your help. I'm going to rescue. You going back in? I got no choice. Look, someone's got to help these people. Well then, brother, you got a real death wish. Maybe. Come on, my office. Take whatever you need. Tell me something. What good are you gonna do her if you get yourself killed? Church, help me. The two of us together, man. With our backgrounds. No, 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 bro. I already told you, man. Not everybody can be a hero, kid. Then let me borrow your boat.
Wait a minute. Go! 
turned stone back in there. I didn't let him do anything. You're in charge now, remember? You let him slip through your fingers? That's your problem. It means somebody's doing something. Somebody's on the grounds. Rescue party. I don't think so. They're not talking about soldiers or men. They're talking about one person. One? They sent one guy after us? They keep calling him the American. heard you when you pronounced him dead. I will cut out his heart! Continue with the plan. Where are you going, Blondie? Ah! 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 Stop pumping around. Tell me where they are. Where are they? Where are they at? They never talk. They never talk. They never talk. give you a message. He's in the boiler room. He can't go anywhere. Lock it down! Make sure this time he dies. Talk 
didn't you? You disappoint me. We've heard from the Americans. They have the tribute. You come with me. We have not harmed you. We have not harmed any more of your people. We have kept our word. Yes? Finalize the transfer. But only after the... Only after the hostages have been released. Money doesn't go to happy meals. Weapons, warriors, a thousand more men like me dedicated to the cause. Plus a few of the goodies. Hey. Hey. What do you guys do? Hey, what are you doing? Finishing what we started. These noble volunteers. Will help us bring down this monstrosity once and for all. You got your money, right? You send your message. This is the message. I helped you. I helped you. Don't make us laugh. You're a worm who thinks he's a crow. You could have done this without me. Finally, Sean. You get something. Exactly. Right. Please. Please! Freedom fighter! Like you say in your book, Mr. Connor, why shouldn't I have it all? Ask her. What? <laughs> You disapprove. You've never sacrificed innocence to get the job done. Innocents always die in war. But the goal is to save people, not kill them to win. You see, you do understand what it means to make a statement.
they secure it. They secured. Brother, talk to me. Come back. How are they secured? They teach you that in the army? Nice shot. There's double up. What can I say? Thanks. Hey. Sir. Come in, brother. Do you hear me? Go get him. Dirk cut. Hurry up. Okay. Are you there, brother? Move, move, move! Come in, are they secured? Are the prisoners secured? Someone come back now! They're coming. Go back. Kill them all. Yes, sir. No!
hell of a show, huh?
I thought my job was dangerous. I love you so much. Let's go home. Uh.